We train young, upcoming, and want to be aerial applicators. We're just north of the facility, the Delta State campus, uh, that does all the training prior to coming into the ag program. They, the students get their instrument and commercial rating through the university, and then they're passed on to us, and then we start we start our training, our rigorous training. This is seven months of hard, dedicated uh, work, commitment. Very proud of what we built in. Extremely proud. We got the university here, that, you know, teaching airline, you know, for airline pilots. You know, the Delta is a person, a unique agricultural leader. You know, and these yellow aircraft are all over the place, you know. So then, so anyway, uh, we're just saying, I want to say we're blessed <laughs> that we're able to do this. What sets it apart is not just the fact that these students and potential ag pilots can come in, get state-of-the-art training um, at a fraction of the cost anywhere else because of the, the funding that we uh, had allocated to us, but also that we're actually using real-life ag pilots as the instructors. I mean, we've allocated a ton of hours in these aircraft and are able to share our experiences with these students and really immerse them in the industry. I think that's what sets us apart is, is what we offer in a sense of complete immersion. We're not just teaching them how to fly the airplane, we're teaching them in the street side of things. Mm -hmm. You see a whole new level of confidence and it's it's really rewarding to see because we track them very closely with their work. We, we keep uh, records of their spray patterns and things like that. And from the first day to the second, or not second day, but the last day, so neat to be able to flip through their logs and see uh, their hard work in there and their knowledge start to come together and get applied yeah. to what we're teaching. I, and I really get to see the difference yeah. I, uh, from the first day down to the last day. I mean, that's a whole, they're, they're, they're a whole different pilot might lead to in a good sense. Getting to see an impact that we have on the future of this industry and not then we're setting a new parameter in our flight train. We're, we're trying to set a new standard of safety, efficiency, and accuracy for our industry. Because so many guys come out knowing just enough to be dangerous in the past. Mm -hmm. And we wanted to change all of that and you know, set a new bar and a new point for our industry. Because it's, it's inherently dangerous. And so the best chance that we can give these guys to go home at the end of the day, we're going to do everything we can to that easy. The reason why I wanted to be an ag pilot is because I've grown up around farming my whole life and I just really wanted to help the industry as I've grown up and yeah. uh, that was that was the only way that I could see that I could cope out this industry was to come across the street. Sure. The reason I wanted to be an ag pilot was growing up I used to watch them spray in my house and I was just was drawn to it. It was like that would need. I really wanted to do that someday. The most exciting part of the training was definitely getting in the acre too. That's it. And uh, that was also the hardest part too. It was learning to be able to control it and uh, land it effectively. The hardest part was yes. probably just getting used to everything and everything moving so quickly and everything. Yeah. But it was definitely one of the coolest experiences ever.